us now is Dr. Anuj Saxena, Managing Director at Elder Healthcare. Uh, thank you for joining us on Profit. Uh, let's first talk about your recent deal with uh, Polar Chemical Industries. Uh, what does this uh, deal bring to the table in terms of revenue, uh, opportunities? Well, good morning. Uh, firstly, uh, the tie-up itself is very significant for the company because Polar is one of the biggest OTC companies, not only in Japan but worldwide and one of the di biggest direct-to-home servicing companies. Uh, for us, the tie-up opens up a stable of products. Uh, we're starting with a range of four or five products in the skin uh, whitening range, which is one of the fastest-growing segments in the Indian consumer. And obviously, after these are launched and we succeed, we uh, hope to bring lots more products. Um, in terms of revenues, we expect that these initial products in the next three years or so should gather revenues of about 20 crores or more for us for the company. Fine. Just wanted a little more clarity on that. Uh, you know, Polar uh, premium kind of range is it's positioned in the premium range. Uh, what margin impact in detail terms does this have for you? Uh, positive. I won't reveal the exact numbers, but definitely positive because, like you said, it's a premium range of products. We're getting to a top-end segment of the Indian consumer who can afford uh, the product. That's why, if you see, we're looking only at 20 crores in the next three years. Uh, obviously, high-priced products also become, bring with them good margins. So in terms of the profitability of the organization, we definitely expect both the top and the bottom line of the organization to go up. Let's come to your own businesses and your own plans. And you do have plans to expand your own brands this fiscal. Uh, uh, can you give some form and substance to it? Yeah, well, over the last four or five years, we've been building healthcare into a small, strong, stable FMCG company. Uh, you know, Elder as a group has been a pharmaceutical company. And the idea was to independently create healthcare as an FMCG major. So in the last three, four years, we've been having a spate of new launches to take the company forward. And this philosophy will continue uh, eventually, yes, in a year or two. We will bring our own, our own range of products. Currently, we have a lot of in-licensing deals. We work with companies like Tiger Balm of Singapore, Combi of USA, Listex of USA, uh, you know, uh, Shahnaz Hussain of uh, India, VLCC. Uh, and after Polar, we, and we do BU Cosmetics from Germany. And after Polar, we have about two or three more in-licensing products for this fiscal year. Uh, you know, and then we want to consolidate it for a bit before I <laughs> take off again. Okay, you said two or more. Um, any details you can share? Uh, well, they're in the pipeline, but let me sign them all. <laughs> then I'm sure you'll call me back. <laughs> <laughs> that we will do, but um, uh, just in terms of targets for this fiscal, uh, uh, you know, what are you looking at? Um, top line, bottom well, line? The company, I mean, we, you know, we've declared uh, th th uh, this year, we've declared as well about 80 crores for the company, and the company has been growing. 40% for the last three to four years. So I hope to maintain that growth rate, if not more. Definitely not less. Okay, we'll leave it at that. Uh, thanks very much for joining us. And like you said, um, as and when those deals are announced, uh, we do hope to touch base with you. Dr. Anuj Saxena, Managing Director, Elder Healthcare, uh, joining us on the phone line uh, from Mumbai.